Hey everybody, this is Larry coming at you. Hold on, got a phone call. Nope, that ain't nobody. This is Larry coming at you for the outfit of the day. I got on Faces, Faces shirt. This is, um, you can see that, the logo, Faces. My, uh, it's my man's clothing line, and also they got a barber shop, and it's all in the same vicinity, so it's pretty good, man. It's pretty nice. And, um, you just gonna mess up my, my shot like that. <laughs> no, no it's my beautiful girlfriend, Makita. She is, um, wearing the Pocahontas look. You see how she has the braids, um, to the side, all over, you know, mm -hmm. nice earrings. And, um, uh, I'm gonna show you my kicks real quick. These some new shoes I got. These new shoes right there. I don't even know what they are, man, but they are. They nice though, they nice and they comfortable when you walk on. They like some patent leather, something like that. But um, it is day five in Vegas. We're having a nice time. Um, we saw the Circus Soleil show yesterday, which was uh, which was a really good show. Some amazing stuff that, you know, them gymnastic people can do. Um, and uh, we saw the fight on Saturday night, which made may well have dropped us. You know, which everybody knew that was gonna happen. Um, and it's just been a nice time, you know, really nice time, really nice uh, place to be right now. So we're here until Thursday, and today is Monday night. We're going to go to a restaurant that uh, Keita wants to go to. It's Pink Tacos, the West Coast restaurant. Um, I saw Tia and Tamara eat there on their show on the Style Network, and I love that show. And um, when I was doing my research for the trip... As far as places to go, things to eat, Pink Taco was like one of the top places to go. So I'm excited to eat there because I love Mexican food. Yeah, they got a nice menu. So um, I'm going to try the quesadillas. Quesadillas look pretty good on this. I'm going to get a taco at Pink Taco. But let's talk about the fight a little bit. Because Lori is, I mean, I'm a Floyd Mayweather fan. I'm going to post some videos of Floyd and everything of the fight. At the highlight, he cussed out Larry Merchant, and he was just really, I don't know, he wasn't out of character because he's always over the top, arrogant, and talks a lot, but at the same time, Ortiz wasn't even looking when he hit him with the one-two, and I just feel like, yeah, Ortiz head-butted you, he was wrong, two runs don't make a right, let's have an even fight, let's have a good fight, people pay good money. Knocked him out when he wasn't yeah. even paying attention. Yeah, we, we we paid uh, we paid some money to see the fight, but you know it was it was very entertaining. It was good. It was it a was good nice. show. It was good. You um, in Vegas, you have to see the fight. You know, just like Mayweather would say, protect yourself at all times. <laughs> you know, you gotta protect yourself at all times. He let his hands drop. You know, he he knew what he did when he when he headbutted him. Um, he felt that he wanted to apologize to him ten times after he did a dirty Two times. move. He apologized. He was he all in his face apologized. And that's just what happens, you yeah, know. Yeah, but Floyd uh, said in the heat of the moment, you don't hear everything, you don't, you know, like, Ortiz was in the heat, heat of the moment, and I'm not taking up for him. I don't even know him from other than from what I saw on 24-7 on HBO. But at the same time, like, I don't know. I just felt like, what? Like, he wasn't even looking. His guard wasn't even up, and you knocked him out. That's, like, sort of not even good sportsmanship, you know. It's a fight. You know, you, know. you want people to be ready. It seemed like they were still on the timeout, but... Floyd did what he's supposed to do. Oh, sorry. Floyd did what he's supposed to do and dropped him. It is what and, it is. And um, he would have dropped him regardless because he kept on hitting yeah, him Yeah, I right. think Floyd would have won regardless, so but was, I feel like... He was getting in him. Ortiz would have gave him a good fight. Ortiz was going on him, especially right before he hit butted him. It wouldn't have last past the, 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 the seventh, eighth round. I anyway. never really seen Floyd getting hit like that with the other previous fights and stuff like that you know not how this guy even though it was only four rounds and the guy probably only really was getting them like the little bit of the fourth um somewhat of the first and second before he, he really took most of it but that's just my opinion he, yeah he would have lost anyway but you know floyd floyd do what floyd do man yep it was a good fight, though. We, we saw it at the Mandalay Bay um, at the arena. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. but they they showed it on the big screen monitor, so it was a lot of people in there, mm -hmm. um, and it was just a good. It was it was you know it was it was fight good. Right. It was good. It was, it was fun. packed. It was down a lot of here. energy. A lot of stuff going on. It was a good time. So not. all right, so we're gonna wrap it up. But I do want to show my hair, my um earrings, my little tennis bracelet, and then my outfit. <laughs> I have this purse that I got from Old Navy. It's cute. And um, I got it on sale for $18, original price. I think it was like um, $24. And then my romper. Shorts, has pockets. It's sleeveless. It's a little cut out on the back, and you tie it in a bow. My bra strap showing, so I'm not really going to turn around and show that, but it's really cute. And I got this from um, Pac Sun, which is the store that I get a lot of my cute little shirts from. And this was like, I think the receipts are, it says like 29 but it was on sale for $19.99. I'm just wearing it with some black flip flops. And that is it. Hitting the Vegas Strip, going to Pink Taco. We may go to a magic show, right? Yeah, might, maybe. It may be too late. We'll see. All right, signing off. Me and Larry, Las Vegas, Monday. What's this, day five of the trip? Day five, Monday night. September 18th, so you guys will see me in the next video.